Today, we have some bad news for fans of Digimon Ghost Game. This news has been circulating on Twitter and Reddit and elsewhere for a couple of days, but I figured I'd make a video about it for folks who maybe just hear about Digimon news right here on YouTube. Digimon Ghost Game is going on an indefinite hiatus, meaning we do not know when episode 22 will be airing. It could be two weeks from now, it could be two months from now. Toei has not committed to a return date just yet. All we know is that it's going off the air for a little bit. According to Silicon Era, on March 6th, an unauthorized third party attempted to hack Toei Animation's internal systems. Toei actually confirmed last week that it was targeted by unknown hackers. The culprits accessed the studio's network and main website long enough to shut down several of its systems. Toei announced the cyber attack on March 11th with the various shows tweeting out statements from their Twitter accounts. The internal systems that were shut down in order to combat the hack ultimately resulted in the slowing or halting of the productions and so we found ourselves in a situation where shows like Digimon Ghost Game, One Piece, and Dragon Quest are hitting production delays. You know how there was no Ghost Game episode on March 10th? Strangely, that was actually not because of the hack situation, but instead because the broadcast times were being filled with coverage of the Nagoya Women's Marathon. So you might think, okay, as bad as a hack is, the timing is good because we already were taking a week off, right? But unfortunately, it doesn't really work that way. Here on March 16th, it seems like the hack or attempted hack was so severe that Digimon Twitter put out a pretty serious statement the other day saying that Ghost Game will not be returned this week on March 20th, and instead they'll be rerunning Ghost Game Episode 1 during its time slot. According to With The Will, they're going to be using the branding Digimon Ghost Game Selection, and they will continue to use that branding until the show returns with Episode 22 at a still to be determined date. Now does this mean we're starting from Episode 1, then Episode 2, then Episode 3, all the way up to Episode 21? Not necessarily, don't get too worried yet. The Ghost Game Selection branding really makes it sound like these are going to be, well, selections, like curated picks of the episodes that best represent the series so far. So for instance, maybe they'll do episode 1 on March 20th, I don't know, episode 13 on March 27th, we don't know yet. I won't pretend to understand the nature of the security breach, and I don't think we should expect any information about what happened besides getting a return date when they are ready to air episode 22. Ultimately, it's none of our business and Toei doesn't owe us a breakdown of how their internal systems were compromised, so definitely don't be expecting that. As for how this impacts this channel, I'm going to commit to making a March 20th Sunday upload and a March 27th Sunday upload. We'll talk about other Digimon topics without being episode reviews. Obviously, I've done those types of videos before, like the Vital Bracelet review, the top 10 changes in Digimon Adventure 2020, the Appmon video. So I have some ideas for how to fill the gap. But hey, if you ever wanted to request a video idea, now is definitely the time. Comment below with your idea for videos and maybe it'll inspire me. After that, though, if the show is still not back on the air in April, I'm thinking I might take this as a blessing in disguise and give myself like a little YouTube vacation until the show starts starts back up again. Hopefully it does not last that long though and Toei is able to get back to normal. I'm genuinely wishing well for them. I know there's an ongoing kind of YouTubers versus Toei sort of feud like with everything that happened with Totally Not Mark back in December, but a security breach genuinely sucks and it just sounds like it was pretty messy. So I'm, I'm hoping for the best for the whole company. Anyways, that's all. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but we'll get through this talking Digimon every Sunday as we always do with or without a new episode. So thanks for watching, take it easy, and I'll see you in the next video.